Good morning, guys. Welcome to today's video. I'm Kaylin, I'm Gabby's older cousin, and I'm taking over this video. Don't take over my video! Too bad. <laughs> Good morning guys, we are up and early. Kaylin said she already started the vlog today, so that is awesome. Um, we are getting dressed, the girls are upstairs, Sophie is upstairs getting dressed. We are getting ready to go to the beach again, but a different beach, I can't wait to show you guys. Anyway, the best thing about having cousins over is that I can take all of Sophie's old clothes and pass them along. The problem with Grayson, uh oh, I lost the needle. The problem with Grayson is that she's so skinny, I have to, so I'm giving her one of Gabby's old bathing suits here, and she's so skinny, I have to sew it up a little so that it fits her. Anyway, the saga continues with the puppies. A couple of days ago, Macy was sick, and she was sick for about 24 hours. The next day, Toby was sick, and he's still a little bit sick. He's just not feeling himself. He had, uh, he pooped in the crate last night. They don't have diarrhea, they just have like a bit soft poop. And he pooped in his crate last night, and he's lost a little bit of weight because whenever he's so skinny, whenever he is off his food, even for a minute, he loses weight. And now, all of a sudden this morning, Cookie started puking. Right, Cookie? Are you sick, honey? Yeah, you guys have the flu. They're all just cuddled up. Yeah, they're just cuddled in a ball in, in Gabby's legs. This has never happened before. Our dogs have never all got sick at the same time. It's really weird. It is super weird. I was sitting on the couch and I looked over and there was a big pile of puke and all three of the dogs were sitting there. I was like, all right, who puked on the couch? And I looked at Cookie and she had puke all over her lips. So we know it was her. Look at Toby, he's so skinny. Toby, are you okay in there? Smelling Gabby's butt, are you okay? Yeah. They just look so sad, it's scary to me. I wish it wasn't Sunday. If it wasn't Sunday, I might take them to the vet, but I know they've, I don't know. I just, I don't know, I'm just gonna hold out, see if they get better. If anything changes for the worst at all, we'll be going in. All right, tell the truth. Have you ever braided your hair when it looks all matted like this? All right, tell the truth. Have you ever done it? Have you ever, have you ever just braided your hair in a big, huge mess that it is? Sometimes it's just gotta happen. Anyway, we're headed out. I'm just making sure I have everything because our house is still a mess from yesterday. All right, so we are where we always can. It's the first time this season because the weather's been bad. Look at this. Three little girlies, all wrapped in towels. Well, wrapping in towels. Anyway, we're headed down to the beach. There's the pool. And we are gonna head there second, but first we're gonna go down to the beach. The beach has been closed this whole summer. It's just now open. Also, my sister camps here, so I'm a different sister than yesterday. So I'm hoping that we can see her at the beach. Out of the beach. See if we can find Jackie. Don't go too deep. Is it warm? Whoa. Well, it's gotta be warmer than the lake. Yeah, it is. I like the beach better. It's not as warm as usual. It's weird. No, it's because we went in the lake, so it's really warm for you. Cold for me. Yeah, it's super full. 
Oh, it's actually gorgeous. Mommy, I like this. Where is pool. that? That goes in the pool. You like the pool? What do you like better, lake or pool? Pool. Lake? Lake. 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 Jeremy likes the black pool, but yeah. Pool. All right, show me your walking handstand. Okay. Walking handstand. And I can hear her. Alright. Both of them down at the same time. Whoa. I'm gonna go in the shallow and I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna get in. It is gorgeous. Fastest way to clear the pool. Big huge clouds. Big huge dark clouds. What? Just thunder. And thunder. And thunder. Everybody's out. We got booted out of the pool by the thunder and the lightning. We were super scared. Were you guys scared? No. no. I don't want to be swimming when there's lightning. It scares me. Anyway, the girls are changing. This is the bathroom. This is all I can show you because over on that side are, are changing girls. Anyway. This, when I go out the door here, here is the rec hall and next week when we're camping I here. Oh. Gabby needs help with her bra, I'll be back. All right, is everybody ready? We all have messy hair. They all came in completely different clothes, but somehow they changed their outfits after their swim. Hashtag girl life. No, I came in my I need a second pair. Of you guys know what it's like to put your clothes on when your body's all wet from the pool? It's not easy, right? Yeah. Anyway, we are headed out and this is the rec hall. I'm gonna give you guys a tour. Oh, come on. There's an old man. Old man sitting at the chair playing on his phone. All right, let's head out. Let's go. You're gonna go to the park? All right, let's throw our bathing suits in the car. So this is the way down to where we'll be camping. I love it because it's all tree lined. I love walking down this little tree line thing. Even though we could go camping a million different places, we used to have a huge trailer here. And we always come back here because it's just so cozy and cute and nice. And we're definitely gonna get flooded soon. It's about to pour. All right, you guys go down to the, to the park and we'll meet you there in a minute. Why? We're just gonna go look at our campsite. The girls are going down to the park. We'll, we'll meet you there in a minute. So this is where we're gonna be camping on the weekend. Next weekend we're gonna be camping. I think I probably said that five million times already. It's so cozy and nice here. Don't you love it, Sam? Isn't it cool? I like going different places. You like going different places? Yeah. I like coming here, it's my favorite. So that one ours right there. So this is our campsite over here. Bathroom is right up the hill, down the hill, and this is our site. And the best thing about it is it has water and electricity. This one right here? Actually, it's that one right there. The bad news about camping next weekend is that Sam sold the trailer this morning, right? <laughs> All right, so we found the girls at the park, playing over there in the Look, sand. I put a gravel driveway. Yeah. There they are, Pirate Ship Park. And they got nice benches over here for us to sit on. Look, look at this adorable little house. This is a crooked little house. Kids' crooked house. Can you hold these? Sure, I'll hold them. They took the swing set out. Did they? That's too bad. Why? Probably dangerous. How are they dangerous? They're just swings. Yeah, but people, some a couple of years ago, somebody broke their leg on one of those swings. Not my fault. We are at a secondhand store, and we came to check out because Sylvie's on a Lilith's Pet Shop kick because her cousin Grayson loves Lilith's Pet Shop. Anyway, we're walking along, and I swear my kids have Schleich sensors built into their brains. So we're walking along, and Sylvie yeah. says, oh, Schleich, and she grabbed this bag. And she found this little foal in there. It doesn't look like Schleich. And she's like, no. no. She's like, I know this is Schleich. And so Sam took a picture of the little thing under the under there and it's definitely no. Schleich. We're not looking for Lily's pet shop. Now we're looking for Schleich. So all these bags, there's a possibility of more Schleich. Like look at this. 
There's some horses. Whoa. Maybe they're briar. No, they're not briar. I'm gonna find the schlike. Probably. No. Sophie's got schlike sensors built in. Littlest pet shop or schlike. Littlest pet shop right there, that pink thing. The problem is that you have to pay like $5 for each bag, so you're paying like $5 for each one little toy. One horse and one little as pet shop. Wait. I'm in this Sophie's room, just getting her hair done. She's fresh out of the bath. How do you feel? Good. Fresh, clean, and I'm sitting here with the puppies, you guys. Ugh. Don't they look pitiful? Toby, look what happened to him. He looks like skin and bones. They've had two baths today. Look at how skinny he is. Anytime he doesn't eat for like a minute, he gets so skinny because he's so skinny to begin with. So scary though. He gets so skinny easily because he's small. Yeah, but at least he's walking around. And loving. Yeah. And cuddling. Looks like he's feeling a little better. We got home from the beach today and Cool. Somebody pooped in their crate again, so they had a bath this morning. I woke up to poop in the but crate. But there's a lot more. Yeah, it's not. It wasn't too bad. It's just that they poop and then they walk in it, and then the whole blanket inside their cage is covered in it. So they had a bath, two baths today, right? Two baths today. Anyway, I am so. I feel so bad for them. I've read up on it. I read up on it a lot and it said that basically you just need to let their bellies heal up a bit and not let them eat, but it's hard when they're chihuahuas. It's okay not to let a 125 pound dog eat or even an 80 pound dog eat, but to let a two pound dog not eat for a couple of days, it's really sad. It's sad. Anyway, um, Sam said that Abby didn't eat her supper tonight either. So she's can't... dying. No, she's not dying. Oh my gosh, don't even say that. But yeah, it's just weird. It's never happened to us before like this. It's crazy. Anyway, Sophie is getting ready for bed. She was up, she stayed up till midnight last night and then she was up super early. So she is done. She is toast. Anyway, she's so super sad because she can't sleep with your dog. Why can't you sleep with your dog? Because she's sick. Because she's sick. I know, it is super sad. She's sick. She can't stay in your bed. She's super sad because she's never slept without her puppy before, but we can't leave them there because one, they need some drinks. I don't want them getting dehydrated, so they need to have their their drinks in their bed. And also, I don't want them to, I don't want the dogs to get up after the kids have gone to sleep and then poop all over their bed. Today I've been cleaning their crate, all their bedding. I've been bathing them so many times. Oh man, it's just been terrible. I do not want to do all the beds tomorrow because the dogs pooped all over the girls. Sobe, do you want Cookie to poop all over you? She's just super tired. Whenever my kids get overtired, they cry. In Gabby's room, she's getting ready to do her hair. Girls have just had a bath. They always need a little bit of help brushing their hair after because there. it is so naughty. Anyway, she part my hair. Anyway, Sophie was in bed last night so late. When we have sleepovers, it would, they end up going to bed so late. I went to bed and at like 10.30. You went to bed at midnight. At midnight 30. So late. But then Sophie was up at the crack of dawn. She's over there in her room. You might be able to see her over there. Is it weird that you can lay in bed and see your sister in her room? Yeah. Yeah. She's super sad that she can't sleep with her dog. We sleep with her dogs every single night, but now that they're except sick. Except for last night. Yeah, except for last night, and they can't, it, like, literally, they are throwing up. Toby threw up in my bed last night. I do not want to be washing, bedding in the morning, and they need to be close to their water because I don't want them to get dehydrated. Anyway, we are going to end today's video. We had an awesome day. I hope you guys had an awesome day. I hope you had an awesome weekend. Yeah. There's gonna be a little bit of a change to our riding schedule this week. Our first riding video is not gonna be up until Wednesday this week, and it's gonna be an extra special one. Anyway, that is it for today. I hope you guys had an awesome weekend. We did have an awesome weekend, and I'm really excited about next weekend, and I can't wait to share it with you. Plus, we have a few other really exciting things coming up and you're not gonna to wanna to miss, right? Yeah. Anyway, yeah. that's it, yeah. and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. Bye.
And don't forget to make sure to hit that subscribe button down below.